Hi, it's James Stewart from marketingwithjames.com and you're watching a quick video on how to install WordPress into your web space. Um, now, the page that we're at here is the um, control control panel or C panel if you like for HostGator. You will get the, the web address to, to your control panel uh, with your HostGator account in your welcome email when you register for hosting with HostGator. Uh, if you bookmark that uh, web address, because you probably come to this uh, page quite a lot and it, it is quite handy to have it bookmarked so you remember what it is. Um, now, HostGator has a really, really cool feature actually, um, which makes installing WordPress really, really easy. And, and, and to be honest, I'll be quite honest with you, trust me on this one if I can do this then absolutely anybody can it really really is easy and it's made easy by HostGator it's a really cool feature um, which is called Fantastico Deluxe which if you scroll down the page you'll just find here if we click on that okay and you get to this page here now what you need to click on at that page is um, the little WordPress tab which is on the just on the left hand side here so we'll we'll click on that Okay, you see the only thing that's changed here is that we're now on to this page here. Um, what we need to be clicking on is the, the new installation tab, so we'll click on this. Okay, so now on this page, what we need in this box here, uh, install on domain, is the name of the domain which you've purchased previously, okay? Um, that domain name needs to go into that box there. Uh, don't worry about the installing directory box, leave that blank. Uh, the admin access data, uh, you need to generate a username uh, and a password. Uh, I'll show you what that's going to be used for uh, very, very shortly. And that really is about it. You can put in there an admin email, um, which is your email address. Uh, whichever email address you want to put in there, you can put any email address in there. Um, you can also put a site name as well. And you basically, once these boxes are filled out, uh, you just need to hit on the install WordPress um, and it really really is that simple um, when you install WordPress um, you will also receive another um, website address URL which is going to take you basically to um, the control panel for, for your uh, WordPress um, site um, which you can go into and, and configure and everything else uh, it will look something like this Okay, when you type in the URL which you get sent, uh, that's where you, your username um, that we've filled out here, the admin access data, the administrator username and password that we've filled out in these boxes here, these are what you'll use here, okay? Um, and like I say, that'll get you into your control panel um, for WordPress or your WordPress dashboard where you can start configuring. But we'll go through that um, another time, okay? But for for now, um, for, for uploading WordPress into your, into your web space, onto your domain name, it really is as simple as that, guys. And we'll see you in the next video.